So today's video is going to be the what I read in March and April. We've got dreadful background and dreadful angles today, so we're just going to make that work. So let's just get into it. So I finished the Scruffy Puppy and I moved on to this book, The Rescue Puppy. Basically, Georgia and Adam get a puppy as a joint ninth birthday present round where they live they live near a super busy road which they have to cross in order to get anywhere so their parents aren't happy about them taking lucky out on their own but they're like going on holiday to this seaside place in suffolk and they're excited to take lucky with them Lucky loves running along the beach, playing in the waves, digging in the sand, seaweed, he even finds a dead fish. And Georgia and Adam are looking forward to taking him for a walk on their own for the first time. But then they start fighting over who takes the lead. And Georgia like drops it and Lucky goes over the cliff and... Lucky's hurt, and then they call the Coast Guard, the Coast Guard rescue, and then they take Lucky to the vet. And that's how it is. I've now finished it, but it took quite a while to finish. There's not as many books in this one. Because I didn't really finish them. And then I'm moving on to Ella, the homesick puppy. I've shown this in videos before, but basically Megan is moving house. So there's like packing and getting ready to move. And she has a golden retriever puppy Ellie and Tid for taking her on walks during the countryside. Mum and Dad are worried about Ella getting away, so Ella goes off to Grand's to have a stay during the move. Ella gets homesick and has never been separated from Megan before. Megan misses her and Ella escapes from her Grand's house, from Megan's Grand's house and goes to the old house and realises no one's there and then finds her way to the new house and that I haven't started it yet but I'm looking forward to still carrying on with Gatsby Gatsby is such a beautifully written book and I've spoken about it in vlogs and that and it's just about like as far as I can tell it's like about 1920s living and that and the time of the flapper girls and that and all of that sort of thing and it's really beautifully written it has so many amazing motifs like the weather if i've got that correctly a motif if i've got it correct <laughs> so and also about like women in that time and how they were like treated like sort of talks about that and you sort of see female representation at the time of the book so sorry if it was a little short and um, been super busy so i haven't really read though i did read to like page 68 so I'm going to end this video here, so I hope you've enjoyed this quick video, this quick book update. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you in another video. Bye.